Hello, Clashers! We have a great strategy today. Town Hall 10, Bowlers and Miners 3-star uh, from yours truly. And let's break it down for you, and I'll show you the best way to go about doing it. So, I've seen this done, but I found that on this max defensive base, again, except I'm not a ma I don't have max heroes. My first attack here, I'm going to really speed it up. As you can tell, coming with the Bowlers on one side, I thought, hey, I'll use the Miners on the other side to get to that second inferno tower as quickly as possible I thought hey that's the best strategy no do not do that I know it's a quick video there it was a failed attack so I'm gonna skip down here to my successful one very quick video today so the goal here obviously creating that funnel going to bring in the bowlers and then I learned right away to bring in the miners behind the bowlers this way the miners aren't caught alone by themselves and they're working together both the bowlers and the miners working together in unison to take down the base otherwise what I found out to be true was um, it, it just wouldn't work out if you did it two separate attacks again that rage spell in the middle really didn't do good for me I almost got this three star even uh, once I changed up the strategy I think I would have had it if I had that extra heal spell and as you'll tell I'm gonna switch out my spell compilation so I'm gonna do one jump one rage and three heal and that way it'll best suit purposes now here is another attack same sort of uh, uh, base layout of course same base layout same strategy as well gonna bring in the bowlers that time the king went around the base unfortunate there so just showing you quick replays and finally we're gonna get to the three star and just show you what went right and how it hurt worked so again just creating the funnel very important for this early stage of the attack I'm gonna bring in a couple miners now the key here is obviously uh, drop the bowlers first. You want to drop the bowlers and then the king, I found. Because you the king goes a little faster than the bowlers, and you don't want the king all by himself. The king really needs to survive. Here comes the miners, you can tell. Uh, I'm bringing them on either side and summon the core. And what this is going to do, um, they are going to take down the bases on the flanks. The bowlers are in the center, miners on the flanks, and I'm using two heal. Now, once the heals reach those side compartments where that wizard tower is and some of those skeletons that's where a lot of hit points are and I need those heal spells to make sure um, they path correctly again spring three heal so I'm gonna use the final heal spell for the miners now I choose to use the miners on the west side the heal on the west because I thought there was more defenses on the west and the queen was kind of uh, helping the miners to the east north uh, and so because of that important heal placement at the end, I was able to get the three star. The queen is still alive and she was able to take down that inferno tower and the rest of the base will go down very quickly. Anyways, I love this attack with, a, with the new update beam and you can't use queen walks as well. The bowlers and miners um, is a great strategy to use. Anyways, thanks again for watching and we will see you next time. Halo out.